Good morning, everyone. It is currently 7.30. I am back in LA now. I got back last night. Um, I am just finishing up some upload stuff, and then I'm going to head off to Orange Theory. I have a class at 8.30. I haven't done Orange Theory. This is the longest I've gone without going since I um, started, so I'm probably going to die this morning. So that'll be super fun. But today, I'm just going to be getting back into my routine, reorganizing, cleaning, everything. It's basically like a post- travel day like what i do to get back in my routine and then tonight maddie you guys have seen her definitely on youtube i've collabed with her i'm like obsessed with her she's in town so we're getting dinner which will be really fun but today is just gonna be like a really getting your life together day and i'm excited about it oh my gosh guys it's kind of sprinkling and so gloomy i am so happy if you guys know me you know that i love this weather i'm so happy that it is like this okay so i have my swell bottle trying to show you guys what I take to Orange Theory. I take in my purse, but I just, I don't use it. I don't really know why I take it in. And then, guys, I swear, where's my heart monitor? This isn't funny. My heart monitor. <laughs> if you guys watch my vlogs, you know that that goes missing all the time. I just like need to know where it goes. Like, it's just bizarre. And then I take in my heart monitor, but it's not here. Like, it's always in my car. I leave it in my car because not because, you know what? It's probably in my gym bag. Okay, guys, I found it. Thank God. So, basically, these are my must-haves for Orange Theory. My purse, my swell water bottle, whatever water bottle I'm bringing for the day. Sometimes I bring my Hydro Flask. It just depends. And then my heart rate monitor. Oh. I'm dead. I got my pink flamingo smoothie. I get this with peanut butter and I get the 24 ounce. It's the best breakfast. Honestly, that might be too much for me today. Just finished Orange Theory. I died. I like actually died. Like I'm so dead. But I'm about to do a little bit of shopping for my house. I'm gonna put AirPods in and listen to a podcast because I really don't want anyone talking to me like at all. <laughs> Can't do that right now. So I'm just gonna shop a little bit and see. This camera is still dying. I will talk to you guys later. Alright guys, so I'm sorry that I didn't vlog much while I was out running errands. I ran errands for like three hours. I did a lot of shopping. I have possibly the biggest unboxing slash haul to show you guys. I'm gonna go shower and then I will do that. But like seriously, and I need to show my groceries. So I think I'm gonna do my groceries, shower, and then show you guys. Like I'll give you a little sneak peek. Well, one thing that you guys can't see today, but I very exciting thing. I finally replaced these chairs. They're on their way. They're gonna come tomorrow. This green rug that's gonna be awesome so basically picture this green rug here and then green velvet chairs and it's all just so much better i just did so much shopping i got some stuff at ross um look at how cute this thing is you guys will see but i'm like absolutely obsessed with it and then i got a bunch of candles at target because they're having a sale which is only 15% off, which is literally a dollar off the candles. So I was basically scammed. And then I have all of these boxes. I don't want to get too close because I don't know if my address is blocked, but I have, let's count. Yeah, so there's eight. And then I have this huge box from Vital Proteins that I'm really excited about because I recently am like, I'm, I'm on a collagen kick, so it's good. All right, guys, so I am going to do a little grocery haul. Oh my gosh, this is so much darker. No. Okay, I'm vlogging my DSLR because I left my G7X charger in Texas, which I have done this so many times, guys. I've probably spent $600 at least on G7X chargers because I always forget them when I travel. It's so annoying. But I'm gonna do a little grocery haul for you guys and show you guys what I got. All right, I was actually already recording this and then my camera messed up, so I have to re-record it. Um, okay, almond milk, brown rice, definitely meant to get couscous, chicken, dates, um, strawberries for salads, Brussels sprouts, I'm actually gonna make this really cool Brussels sprout like bacon maple syrup dish that I will show you guys, very exciting. Um, I almost said almond milk, these are definitely avocados. <laughs> no, 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 no. Um, these are just grilled strips for like grilled chicken strips that I'm just gonna throw in salads. Here's the bacon, I don't know whose this is, it's just on my counter. Blueberries, maple syrup, goat cheese so guys i really like goat cheese on my salads but trader joe's has like no selection and i don't think that's even gonna work for salads so i guess we'll see eggs balsamic vinegar um walnut halves for my salad that is not mine kale and then some more lettuce so this is 
what I got from Trader Joe's. It is very, very exciting. Little overview. So the really exciting thing today is that I ordered a lot of kitchen stuff and kitchen replacements. So I'm gonna be like reorganizing. I base, I'm literally doing so much. We are unpacking, reorganizing, unboxing all that stuff, throwing away all that trash, which is gonna take a second. Um, I got some new house stuff that we're gonna be setting up. It's very exciting. I'm very pumped for today. So I'm gonna put this away and then I will talk to you guys once I shower. All right. All right, so I just got ready really, really quickly, like a no makeup look. I put a little bit of mascara on. I'll show you guys the products that I used. Okay, so the first thing I used is this tiger grass cream I mentioned in a past vlog. Look at also these, these um, sweats. Guys, what a major throwback. If you know, you know. Comment down below if you know. Um, anyways, this tiger grass cream, I don't feel like it cancels out my redness as great. It just doesn't really at all. I just like it as an actual moisturizer, but the Dr. Jart tiger grass cream in the jar completely cancels your redness out. So if you guys are looking for that, get the jar. I wish that I would have gotten the jar, but I got this. And I like it as a moisturizer. It makes my skin like still feel really good and very moisturized. So... That is, I don't know. Then this Laneige lip mask I got um, because Maggie McDonald always talks about it. It's amazing. I absolutely love this. I love lip products and this is like one of my favorite I've ever used. So I'm really excited about that. And then I just brushed up my brows and put a little bit of mascara on. And that is my look for today. So I need to unpack this pretty bad, but I'm gonna do that later. I'm gonna completely clean my room and do all of that. In the meantime, I have this laundry I need to do first. So great. Okay, I am going, I don't even know where to start. I have so many things to unbox. This is the unbox haul part. So we'll start with Ross, it's the closest one to me. You're sitting on a box, like this is really insane. Okay, I got this little KitchenAid whisk, cause it was $4, I like, this is like OG YouTube. I'm so hungry, I can't even focus, but I just don't have, you know when you go grocery shopping, you get all this stuff to meal prep, like I'm planning on meal prepping today, but I'm not gonna eat something like, that I'm making right this second. So, I ordered food. Um, <laughs> I ordered Takaya, and it's on its way. Takaya is like actually the best. It's cute KitchenAid whisk with a little, it's just cute, you know? Then, I got these little um, coasters to put on the kitchen table since I'm fixing this area. This is probably my favorite thing I got. Look at how cute it is. I'm just really excited for this. A nice cute pink pot. Love it. I honestly want like an entire kitchen set in this color because it's so cute, but I'm very excited about that. Okay, I have this really, really, really big bag from Ross. I got two pillows, two of these for the couch, and then I got this little rug that I'm just going to put in the entryway because it was so cheap. Perfect. I got this really big, oh, Joe's coming in. Got this really big green large rug. It's amazing. Okay, really quickly, I'm gonna go through the candles that I got at Target. Okay, I don't like the tacky looking candles. Like, I really don't even like Bath and Body Works are like ugly. We have to get on this, you know? I like all the Anthropology candles. Those are my favorite, they're just really expensive. But um, I got these from Target, very cute. I got another one of these. Smells actually amazing. I'm gonna put them out here. And then I got a candle that's like a eucalyptus scent. That smells really good that I'll put in my bathroom because I have a lot of like eucalyptus stuff in my bathroom. It's very relaxing. I got this little, is this a diffuser? I've never had one of these, but I also like the look of this for out here on this table, this little corner area that I'm fixing. And then I also got a frame because literally all of the frame sizes, the reason that my office is taking so long for the frames is because none of them are normal frame sizes and I think society six does that on purpose so you have to buy their frames and I wish I would have just bought the frames to begin with. Um, but I got that one to see if one of them fit works with it, so I guess we'll see. But it's just so frustrating. It's so annoying. On to the billion Amazon packages and orders that I made over the past week. When I go home, I just think of all the things that I want and need to buy, and then I just get it all done. This is very exciting. Okay, so I got the voting game. So I got the an expansion pack, and in here somewhere, I got the normal voting game. So basically, I host family game night slash dinner, family dinners weekly. It's a very big thing. It's a very, I'm very excited about it. You know, Monday we're doing John and Finney's pasta. Very pumped. I'm going to do a whole vlog too on like how I prepare for that and like how I host it basically. Very exciting. Um, 
we play the boating game. This is my favorite game. I will have a link down below. I hate games and I love that one, so it's good. Okay, so this is a PR package, but this is from Pharmacy. I didn't realize how expensive Pharmacy was until I was in the Sephora recently, but unless I'm thinking of a different one. This is their Honey Grail line. So, ultra hydrating facial oil. Very excited for that. I don't know if you can even. I'll test it out. And then, our 100% raw, all natural buckwheat honey from California. Oh, that's so cute. They gave me honey. So, thank you so much. I one of my four large Amazon packages. Oh my gosh, okay, I got more meal prep containers, and then I got a 15 pack of mason jars, but I feel like these are a little bit smaller, and I wanted these for overnight oats, that was my vision behind it. Didn't realize there was 15, so I don't know what I'm going to do with all of them. Okay, the next one, I got a knife set. I have never had, like, a big knife set since moving out. It's I've almost been moved out for, like, four years now, which is crazy to think about, but, like, literally for four years, I've gone without, like, large knives which is very difficult when you're a chef now, you know? So I had to get more. I got new mixing bowls because mine are trash and I really just needed new ones, so. And then I just got new cups, a set of eight of them. Very good. Then here, oh, I got new bedding. Um, I'm gonna replace my bed too. So I just got, I want it to be very like hotel room vibe, so it's all white, so that's really easy. I got these two little marble jars, I can't say it. So I just got two of these. I'm gonna put coconut treats in them throughout the house so I can have them ready. Okay, I got two pillows that are packaged so tightly. This is just two new baking pans. So I will show you guys more of this when we the kitchen. But okay, so Vital Proteins just sent me a package which is convenient timing because I'm getting into collagen now. So very, very, very exciting. Um, but basically Vital Proteins, pure collagen and nutrition. So they gave me collagen water, collagen peptides, and then collagen shots. So this is the apple cider vinegar and raspberry and lemon. This is the chamomile and lemon. There's so many shots. Thank you so much, Vital Proteins. This makes me very excited. Um, but yeah, collagen shots, cleanse. I'm very, I'm like actually so pumped. So this one is the cleanse, and then this one is the zen, which makes sense because it's chamomile and lemon. But I will keep you guys posted on how I like this stuff. I'm so excited. Okay, so here are my new kitchen supplies. Here's my new knife set. Um, this was really cheap on Amazon, so I'm sure it's like not a great knife set, but I just needed something. Like I literally have never had anything. Got new mixing bowls, new cups, new baking pans. Okay, so I accidentally got 15 of these, but these are like the perfect size for overnight oats. The mason jars that I use are always like, there's just too much food, and then you don't finish it all, and it's really annoying. And I So the cha cha matcha ones are probably like two thirds the size of this, but this is honestly like, just I feel like the perfect size for overnight oats. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with 15 of them, but that's perfect. And then I got more meal prep containers. I have meal prep containers, but mine have um, like compartments in them and I wanted some that didn't have compartments in them and then my beautiful pop That's so cute like guys. Have you seen that? That's just so freaking cute. Just threw away all of those boxes it Took me 15 minutes. Okay, this doesn't look organized, but it is so I'm gonna take all of these these are dirty clothes These are clothes that I don't want to wash the same way and I'm gonna take these to the washroom and do some laundry Okay, so I just ordered Takaya off caviar. I will have my um, code down below if you guys live in LA Basically you get free $20 credit if you use my code. This is not sponsored or anything I just love caviar um, and it like covers food. It's not just delivery services. So this was like a $25 thing and I got it for eight Amazing, okay, so the Takaya was incredible again guys caviar is also my favorite food delivery service It's better than Postmates. They always have deals like I literally got a $25 meal and delivery thing for $8 So check them out. I think they're only in LA. I'm so sorry. I don't know but um, I tried the vital proteins collagen water and it's really really good um, So I'm a fan of this all right, so I just unpacked all that stuff and then I just um, like it got my comforter out, my duvet cover, my pillows, set all of that up. Um, I'm gonna get a white bed and I'm gonna get rid of this. The only thing is that I'm just so intimidated. I'm like getting rid of all this stuff to like take this apart. I just, I don't even know what to do. Like I had someone set it up. Actually, no, I had friends set it up and then my movers rebuilt it. So I just don't even know, like I just want it out of my house so bad. So maybe I'll hire a handyman. That's like from TaskRabbit or something but it's gonna be so much better. I really want my room. I feel like there's studies and stuff that say your room should be the most like 
um, like bare place like even the clutter that I have right now is too much But I just want it to be all white and like all very minimal and just very like mature So I have a few more things I need to order and then I think I'll be good on today's episode We've got a really fun okay. Ooh, I don't think this is gonna I don't know this is all right guys, this is like set up really weird, so I don't know if it's gonna work or not. Um, so I'm currently on my way to Starbucks right now. I really just wanted to try the nitro cold brew with coconut milk. I never thought about putting a milk in it. I just wanted to try. I always get a cold brew with coconut milk and I want to try the nitro one. Anyways, I have a lot of stuff that I need to get done. So I thought that it would be nice to get a little break because I've been cleaning and organizing and just running errands all day long. So since I've been doing that, I really just needed to get out, take Coco on a walk, get a coffee. Wait, I just want to get a coffee and take Coco on a walk and then go work in my office. I need to edit a little bit and then I have some schoolwork. So, oh my gosh, this Starbucks line is actually really ridiculous right now. It's never this bad. Whoa. Coconut zombie. I changed into this top that I got from loft they sent it to me and it is literally the softest thing i have ever worn like ever anyway so i've gotten pretty much everything organized thrown out i took at least 10 trips in the trash can it's so bad i got rid of a lot of stuff and then i also like obviously most of it was the packaging i just needed a midday break where i would get out and i really it's just gloomy out i love this weather really just wanted to take coco on a walk with my coffee so getting my coffee and then we're gonna go to walk and then I'm gonna get some work done in my office. You guys will see that. So, I'm very excited. Hi, well, Mr. Starbucks, what can I get for you? Hi, can I just have a grande nitro cold brew with coconut milk, please? Thank you. <laughs> okay, so I got a grande um, nitro cold brew with coconut milk. I will taste test in a sec. Oh, I think I do like it better than just the normal cold brew. This is the nitro one, which I like it. I had it without the co the coconut milk the other day, and I didn't like it as much, but like, I don't really drink just cold brew black. I drink every, like my other coffees black, but normally with the cold brew from Starbucks, I get like a milk in it, but I'm a fan. Okay, so I'm in my office right now, which is very clean. The carpets got clean last week, and I haven't really been home. So I have my cold brew. I've barely finished it. You can't even get this drink in a bigger size than a grande because that's how much caffeine is in it. Like, they won't give it to you. So that's great. Um, I'm just editing a vlog that's going to go out tomorrow and just planning out some stuff. I'm going to do a little bit of schoolwork as well. I am in summer classes, which is just so fun. I'm only in, well, I'm in two, but I'm only in one right now because there's like two sessions. So I'll be in one each session. So I need to do that and get some work done. I'm just going to like crank out a bunch of stuff in the next few hours. And I'm excited. Okay, it's currently 7. I don't have my dinner reservation until 9. I really don't need to leave until like 8.20 because I need to get gas. So I have like an hour and 20 minutes. I don't know why I'm trying to get ready right now because it takes me like literally no time to get ready. I've been working slash I was FaceTiming Molly for like two hours. Um, and we were working on dates for the Boston trip, which is very exciting. So I got a vlog uploaded for tomorrow. I did some schoolwork. Um, <laughs> did some schoolwork and yeah, I put away some laundry. I've just honestly done a lot of stuff. I'm just so excited for this new breakfast nook area in my house, guys. Like, oh my gosh. That corner is gonna be so cute. I also need to get a rug. Guys, okay, here's the thing. I'm just so over every, like I want my house to be like a little more mature, which like it's not gonna be more mature with like this, but I need a big rug right here. I want like a very big one. And then once I have the rug there, it's gonna be so much better. I need to take this down. This is totally my bad. Part of me just thinks that we're gonna want it for something. I don't know why I think that for like a backdrop or something. I'm gonna keep it and then throw it away at this whatever. But this is like the studio setup. I don't really know how to, I got the white thing to be like way too wide so we can't put it this way. So I don't really know how to make this look neat because like it's just a bunch of equipment and we need this open space. But once all of this is set up, I feel like it's just gonna look so much better. I'm so excited, like literally so excited. And I wanna replace this stuff right here because our Texas thing, I was showing Molly this, this is from Urban. We've had it for like a year now, but it's just like falling apart. I don't know why or like how that happened, but it's just falling apart. So that's not good. Not good at all. 
So, for tonight, I am... Oh, I don't know what jacket I'm going to wear. I wish I had, like, a really big oversized bomber. Like a sports bomber or something. Dang it. Um, I'm just going to wear this black turtleneck because I'm very pale right now. And I just want to throw my hair up in a bun, call it a day, be done, you know? Jeans. These are a little bit big on me. But I really like garage jeans, but they're super small. Like, I'm a size, like, 25 and I wear a size 7 in these jeans. So, like, that's, like, I feel like that's really off. And then I'm hopefully going to wear these shoes from Urban that I got. I still haven't worn them. Also, um, Sav and I are going to Malibu tomorrow and we're going to shoot. So, I'm just kind of getting some outfits together for that. Um, just so I have options that we can bring and I'll just have them prepared for tomorrow. I just want a bunch of, like cute dresses oh my gosh why is it like this okay so I went ahead and I packed my gym bag because I have an early class tomorrow morning at like 7 30 just so I would be prepared and I also laid out all my outfits for tomorrow I will show you I have a big day we're shooting and doing a bunch of stuff so just like I said earlier they're right here I love having this mirror here because now I can like okay my room looks so much better in real life than it does in person it's very dark on here very annoying but for my outfit tonight, I'm just wearing a black turtleneck, black, again, the Olivia J jacket, um, jeans. These are, like, my favorite BDG jeans. Guys, I just, like, don't have any jeans slash pants that, I, like, I feel like are flattering that I like. Like, I just don't like any of my pants. I don't feel good in any of them. So, if you guys have pants that you feel like are very flattering, let me know in the comments down below the most flattering jeans. Not, like, Fashion Nova jeans. Like, I don't want, like skinny jeans like I want like cool pants I don't want like just like skinny jeans you know what I'm saying that are like like that's not my vibe so yeah and then I have these shoes from Urban um I changed the jeans these are not the garage ones these are the Urban ones because the garage ones just like didn't look that good I also actually did makeup tonight so I'm wearing um eyeshadow which is crazy today's just been a really good day but anyways I have hoops on I'm gonna put my earrings on or my rings on um, just like my normal, whatever, nothing too crazy. I need to get a different jacket because I wear this one all the time, but it's because it looks good with everything. Like I need a jacket that like, I just need more jackets. Even though I have like 17,000 jackets, I'm aware I need more. So I'm going to try to give you guys like a better look at, uh, sorry. My neighbors definitely think I'm very weird. Um, so this is the outfit. See, I like having this set up because it's very nice this lens you can see so much okay so i am going to obviously leave this camera here i'm not going to carry this and bring this gracias madre but i'm going to gracias madre with maddie i will have her channel linked down below you guys definitely like, if you like my videos you will love her videos she's just so cool she's in la for like two days i think so i was like okay we're definitely getting dinner so we're going to gracias madre which is one of my favorite restaurants in la i get the chimichanga it's the best thing ever i'm not really feeling the chimichanga tonight but who knows maybe maybe things will change so I'm about to head out and I'm gonna vlog on my phone a little bit and get a few clips I think and then I'll see you guys when I get home It wasn't even recording, okay We're at Gracias Madre with Maddie. We got chimichangas. They're so good. They're like the size of your head, but they're so good All right guys, my room looks crazy because the lights are off and my neon sign is on. Dinner was really fun I'm so full. I'm so tired and I have to wake up very early tomorrow. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog it was a lot and like all over the place. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you guys did by leaving a comment down below. This week I'm doing things. Like not every vlog is going to be me from my house working and going to Orange Theory. Like there's going to be other things. And I am going to do different fitness classes. So don't worry. I feel like things can get really repetitive. But it also is my life. So yeah. Let me know if you guys want to see vlogs. Love you guys so much. And I will see you soon. Bye.